Hello everyone. Let's understand how to add and subtract integers. Look at the first expression. Negative 7 plus 8. So, when we begin the question, we have to understand that what are the numbers which are getting added. See, we are adding negative 7 and positive 8. So, we have 7 negatives and 8 positives. So, the answer will be positive 1. Now, in the next question, we can clearly see that negative 8 is being added to negative 9. So, the answer is clearly negative 17. In the next question, we can see positive 12 is being added to negative 6. So, answer is going to be positive 6. So, now let's move on to subtraction. Look at this expression. The first step is to identify the numbers which are being subtracted. So, we can see that negative 5 and this is the subtraction sign, that is the minus sign, which is telling us to take away. And we have to take away positive 9. If we put the bracket, we are going to understand that we are taking away positive 9 from negative 5. So, now, whenever we subtract, we, we change subtraction to addition and we add the opposite. Let's do that. So, we will write negative 5. So, negative 5 will remain as it is. And the subtraction which will change into addition and ne positive 9 will become negative 9 because we will be adding the opposite. So, this tells us that the answer will be negative 14. I hope it is clear. Let's move on to the next subtraction. Now, here we can see that the first number is negative 6. The second number is already in the bracket. It is negative 8. So, we are subtracting negative 8 from negative 6. So, we will change subtraction to addition like this. We will add the opposite. So, the subtraction becomes addition and we will add the opposite. So, opposite of negative 8 is positive 8. So, what do we get as the answer? We get 2 as the answer. That is positive 2 as the answer. I hope it is clear. Let's move on to the next expression. Now, look at this expression again. If we put a bracket around 5, we know that this is a positive number. From positive 5, we are taking away negative 6. So, the this sign, this is representing the subtraction. That is, we are taking away something. So, now we will... Change subtraction to addition. So, in place of subtra subtraction sign, I will put a addition sign and I will add the opposite. So, what is the opposite of negative 6? It is positive 6. So, now we have both the positive numbers which are being added. So, it will be 11. We can write positive 11 or simply 11. It is the same thing. So, let's look at this next expression. In this expression, first we'll identify which numbers are being subtracted. So, this we are taking this as the subtraction sign. So, when we put the brackets, we come to know that this is positive 6 and this is positive 11. That means we are taking away positive 11 from positive 6. So, we will change subtraction to addition and add we will add the opposite so we will add negative 11 so the answer will be negative 5 i hope it is clear thanks for watching goodbye